The board and the City Management team of Historic Environment Scotland are here in Dumfries and Galloway for the next couple of days doing a number of things, partly visiting a number of the sites which we have in this region, meeting some of our staff, meeting with local communities, with local stakeholders, with local partners with whom we work in developing the historic environment here. Our corporate plan says the historic environment should be cherished, understood, shared and enjoyed by everyone and Dumfries and Galloway has a huge part to play, a huge contribution to make to achieving that vision. We as Historic Environment Scotland have 30 sites in this region, some very well known ones, Calavro Castle, Threve Castle, Lochmaben Castle and many others. There are over four and a half thousand sites here in Dumfries and Galloway, either scheduled monuments or listed buildings, so the heritage and the historic environment assets of this region are hugely important, but they're more important than just the assets in themselves. Over 70,000 visitors visited our sites last year, really important contribution to the tourism industry and to the economy. And of course, we are contributing funding to many projects in the area, over half a million pounds last year alone. So hugely important region, huge contribution to make to our objectives and to Scotland's historic environment aspirations. One of the things which has impressed me is the degree of support and partnership working that we have across the whole of Scotland, whether that's with local authorities, with Visit Scotland, with community groups. Um, and so partnership is vitally important. And one of the things we'll be doing in our time here is meeting many of the partners and many of the stakeholders to share experiences, to learn what's worked and how we can do things better, but really to make sure that we're all aligned and focused on the same objective of making sure the historic environment isn't just something we look back at, but equally as part of our future going forward. It's vital that the people who are working together know the area that they're working in and know the people that they're working with. So it's fantastic that Historic Environment Scotland have come down here today to have a stakeholder event and to see the properties in the locality. I think as two national bodies it's really important that we work together. If you look at the, the heritage aspect and the tourist aspect um, and how we encourage uh, visitors to the region uh, and that collaborative working is extremely important and looking forward to the 2017 themed year and um, history heritage and archaeology I think there are fantastic opportunities for us to link together to build up a collaborative program that will encourage more people to come to the region and visit. We want to make sure that as an organisation we are visible across the whole of Scotland. That means there'll be board visits such as this, but equally other occasions when the board and the senior management team get out and about. And certainly from a personal point of view, getting out and about and being visible across the whole of Scotland is vitally important. Meeting our staff, who are doing a fantastic job day in and day out, um, but also meeting partners, discussing ideas, looking for new projects to take forward and making sure that we're listening to what happens on the ground so that we're all working together to the same end.